Hello friends. Today we will see how MJ is calibrated. MJ is calibrated with the help of a stage micrometer. Here, here is a picture of a stage micrometer. You can see a stage micrometer is a glass slide. It has a circle in the center and inside the circle there is a line. When we see the line, this, uh, this line has actually 100 deviants and each deviant uh, is of 0 0.01 millimeter. When we multiply 0 0.01 millimeter with 100 deviants, then we get 1 millimeter length, which shows that the length of this stage micrometer is 1 millimeter. However, uh, the uh, distance between two consecutive large divisions from this div uh, large division to, to this division, uh, the distance is 100 micrometer. I have some pictures of stage micrometer which I took a while ago. You can see the stage micrometer. This picture was taken at 4x. This is an other picture which was taken at 10x and this picture was taken. Okay, so far we have seen what is a stage micrometer. Now we will see how image J will be calibrated. In, for the calibration of image J, we have to see our actual images. Like I have one image of intestine which was taken at 4x and other image uh, is taken, taken at 10x. For instance, I, would, uh, I am interested to measure uh, the dimensions of uh, image at 10x. I will use this image of state micrometer which is taken at 10x. How I will use it? I will drag this image and drop it in image J. Now you can see uh, this uh, image is open. I will magnify it for my ease. Then I will use this tool. This is a straight segment or freehand line. I will draw a line from one large division to an other large division. Keep in mind that this line should be straight with the divisions and it should start from the middle of first division and it should end in the middle of the second division. After drawing this line, click on analyze then click on set scale a pop-up window will appear it has many information like distance in pixels which is 273 point something uh, this uh, value is dependent upon the camera which is used to capture this image however the second option is known distance. The known distance between two large VNs is 100 micrometer. We will write 100 and we will write a unit of length as UM micrometer. Then we will check the global checkbox. By checking the global checkbox, we are ensuring that all the images that will be used subsequently are taken at 10x. We will click OK and with this our image J has been calibrated. We can use it to measure the size of different objects like I have this image. I will drag and drop it.
okay if i am interested to measure the length of this will lie i will take the length from top to bottom then i will go on uh, on analyze and measure there are different values which includes area mean minimum maximum angle and length basically we are interested in measuring the length which is 84.779 micrometers you can take as many measurements as you like just click and take the next measurement which is 91.171 i hope you have learned the calibration